What is toxicity? Well, toxicity basically describes the degree of adverse effects caused by a substance. So if something is more toxic, it causes more adverse effects, and if something is less toxic, it, the severity adverse effect is lower. If any substance can cause an adverse effect, it is toxic. There are three main types you should know, which are toxicants, toxins, and poison. Toxicants are basically chemicals that can injure or kill humans, animals, or plants, um, often re are related to man-made substances, synthetic chemicals, and things we try to minimize in green chemistry. Toxins are specific substances pro already produced by living organisms. While we don't necessarily manufacture toxins, we isolate them and use them as, as starting materials and intermediates. And finally, poisons are basically a type of toxin, a toxicant that causes an immediate adverse effect. We will now talk a little bit about common toxins. So these are substances, once again, that are produced in nature and often isolated from plants, amphibians, algae, and other species. So we've probably all heard about botulism toxin, which produces paralysis. We've heard about bacterial ecotoxin, which is often the cause of food poisoning pretty much all over the world. Finally, ricin, which is um, isolated from castor oil uh, and essentially acts by impeding protein synthesis throughout the body by um, interacting with the RNA translational machinery inside the cells and making them incapable of performing its normal function, thus disabling um, homeostasis. We'll now talk about some toxicants that are that are not naturally occurring but have been produced by human activity, such as asbestos. Asbestos is a form of fiber, often most common form is of crystalline fiber, which is deposited onto your lungs and when well, when inhaled is penetrates to your lungs, is associated with cancer over time. Lead in the paint is associated with a range of disorders, including developmental disorders in children, and while lead paint has been used in America for quite a while, it's not anymore. In more contemporary issues, there is dioxin. Dioxin encompasses a range of chlorinated compounds, which are usually persistent in the environment due to byproducts of other reactions and can cause a wide variety of negative effects. And dioxin has been a great example of um, unintended terrible consequences um, to human health and is considered one of the most toxic chemicals in, but in the environment. And finally, there is bisphenol A that has been banned from childhood bottles because it is considered to be an endocrine disruptor because it mimics the activity of estrogen and thus has endocrine effects. But um, this, there is some controversy on the subject and no conclusive reports have really been issued by the EPA.